the human papilloma virus. It's most closely linked to women and cervical cancer. HPV, there are 140 different types. Some are low risk, some are high risk. The high risk types are known to cause almost all cervical cancer. Studies show that half of all American men are infected with HPV, and it puts them at greater risk of cancer too. Absolutely. More and more cancers have been shown to be associated with the HPV virus. Among them are head and neck cancers. Many of these cancers are caused by HPV. Prior to 15, 18 years ago, probably 90, 95 percent of my new cancer patients were smokers. But now about 45 percent are non-smokers and the majority of those are caused by HPV. Two-thirds of tongue and tonsil cancers are caused by HPV. 80 percent of them are found in men. If caught early, their prognosis is good. Some of the smaller cancers in the base of tongue and tonsil will treat with radiation alone, particularly if it's HPV related. The HPV vaccine was originally promoted as a girl's vaccine. Since then, the CDC recommended it for boys as well, and not just to stop the spread of cervical cancer, but to keep them safe too. If we prevent the transmission of the virus, then we can prevent the cancer. If you have questions about HPV or the vaccine, consult your doctor. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.